Hey guys, it's Cheer. I just wanted to give you an update on my CDT plans, my trekking plans for 2022. Currently I'm here in beautiful Paso Robles training. Um, and I do hope to get out to the Sierra to um, train as well, probably some at Mount Langley with a friend, and then I'll be off to trail. So what you've seen so far is my trek from 2021 from um, Mexico to Steamboat Springs or New, yeah, the Mexico border to Steamboat Springs. Um, and this year, like I said in my previous video for week 12, um, I plan to make it to Canada with some of my trail family members. Um, I didn't end up going to the AT this year. I said in the previous video that I might hike like 500 miles on the AT, but I've decided to do a full through hike of the AT to finish on Katahdin. So I think I'm gonna be doing that next year in 2023. So um, that's kind of the general plan. And I am starting in Steamboat Springs with Stevie Wonder and Snickers. Um, so Steamboat is said to hold snow later in the year. Um, and this is actually still early to be hiking in Colorado, um, snow wise, from what I've heard. <laughs> so um, we're starting early June in Steamboat. So I'm bringing all of my equipment. I just ordered a Whippet um, in lieu of an ice axe. Um, so over at Thruer, the um, hiking community that I'm involved in. Um, we've had a safety expert on um, named Ned Tibbetts of Mountain Education. And so I learned from him that um, generally whippets are maybe a better option for long distance hikers um, versus an ice axe. So I ended up ordering a black diamond whippet. So we'll see how that um, goes. <laughs> and I'm also gonna probably bring my micro spikes. Um, I don't think I'll need my crampons, but um, we're gonna wait um, you know, until it gets closer for me to decide. So, and that's kind of the conditions I'm seeing right now, at least nobody's really gone through that section yet. And so I'm waiting, I think some, um, folks, um, in 2022, the 2022 class, CDT class, um, have flipped up because there, of course, still is snow in the San Juans and everything. So some people end up flipping from Cumbres Pass, um, up to the Great Basin in um, Wyoming and hiking south. So um, we know of one person who's doing that. So um, hopefully that person goes through before we do. So we kind of know what um, the conditions are like because we have no idea. And um, usually when you're hiking along northbound or southbound, people are ahead of you and you'll see comments on our app that we use. Um, Legacy is called Gut Hook, but now it's called Far Out. They rebranded. So on that app you can usually click like a water source and see what the hiker comments are um the most recent hiker comments are like tent sites not that there are a lot of tent sites <laughs> on the cdt but you can look at different waypoints and see what the update is so nobody's gone through the section that we're going to go through yet i think we're going to be kind of on the front end of everybody because we're starting kind of early um most northbound hikers on the cdt will still be making their way through colorado <laughs> um south of us so that'll be interesting of course i'll keep you updated on that um and i did post all of my 2021 videos of like a year later um so i really slacked on that but this year i plan to give you a more live update so when i'm in town depending on my service i just want to upload all of the weeks as close as possible to when i hiked them so um stay tuned for that i hope <laughs> that makes for better watching because it's real time. I know some people kind of got confused because um, I didn't necessarily say 2021 actually in my videos because I was um, planning to post sooner than I actually did. So um, now it's going to be more real time. So hopefully that's not as confusing anymore. So um, I hope you guys enjoy my upcoming track. And if you have any questions, of course, leave, um, leave anything or comments, <laughs> leave anything in the comment section. I'll get back to you. Um, and I'm also going to hopefully put out a video about my ceramics because um, this channel is really about hiking and my ceramics because my ceramics um, are very closely related to um, my hikes. So um, Dirtbag Ceramics, if you guys don't know, um, I'll be posting a little update on that as well. And in my videos, I'm going to give little clips of uh, what my inspiration is. Um, 
And so I'll go more into that in a different video, because <laughs> if you're not here for that, then we're going to keep it to hiking here. Um, but anyway, stay tuned for everything, and I hope you guys enjoy following along in 2022.